Hello everybody! Recently I could purchase this huge storage. It is 52 liters deep, so you can put a lot of things inside. And here is my doll Hannah to show you how big this storage box is. And I've decided I am going to store all my knitty plushies and all the doll sized plushies. Let's get started. So here is my huge pile. I have been collecting these since my childhood. They are quite small but quite pricey. I have just a few of them which I bought uh, for the retail price. Most of them I bought when they were on discount, on half price, but the most of them I bought at the flea This market. one was released last year. Why I wanted it so much for my boy doll. This rabbit is quite old. It's a flea market find. You can see the nitty sign on it because it was washed a lot of times. Here's a little puppy. This one was a release for Valentine's Day. And I think it's very adorable. Mm -hmm. It's also an old one because you can't really see the tag on it. Okay, I love sheep, <laughs> I can tell. And this one is so cute and very fluffy and soft. And I love them so much. This is also coming from the flea market. Here is another version. This is a standing one. Here is another one. This is a girl and it has got this kind of sweater so you can put your finger inside it. It's very adorable. My other favorites are teddy bears and this one has this beautiful blue scarf. That's why I fell in love with it immediately when I saw it at the flea market. This one definitely is a very very old one. I think it was made uh, about 20 years ago. That was the beginning of Nitty. Uh, you can't see here this sign was that time, so now it's different. Maybe I have got a uh -huh, so here I can have one on this sheep. So if you see this tag, this means that these are the older versions, and the newer one has just the name on it with no duck head. Okay, here is the yeah. Okay, that's a ducky. Here you can see and these were made in the 90s so this one is also coming from the 90s that's a sheep which is kind of very cute legs and here is my cat <laughs> this one is also a rabbit I think it's very adorable with these ears so cute and still fluffy and it has got a very cute little scarf with a rabbit on it and it has got this little tail. Cute! This is a cougar. And nothing special on it. Perfect for my boys. This kangaroo I purchased during the summer time. It was on half price and it has got a pocket so you can put coins in it if you want. It's quite small and very adorable. And it has the real tag on it. Usually there are lots of cards on them. I don't understand why but they put this on them. So here's another sheep from the old collection. It's also still very fluffy and it has got these very cute little ears. This is a bigger version of my cutie rabbit. This one is the lying down version. Here is another cat from the older collection. It still has the logo on the back and that was, uh, I think, also about 30 cents at the flea market. And here is a giraffe. If you want to make a safari theme, you can use zebras, giraffe, elephant and these stuff. And there is also a safari theme, still they have Usually they have the same themes uh, year by year, but they change the animals, so different colors, different faces, and so on. This Ayumi collection is quite new. I bought this Ayumi figurine when I was in England and on the way home in Germany. After I purchased 
this one I could purchase the white version so you can see the same color and here is a parrot I don't know when they had birds it's not so fashionable owls except owls I know and this parrot was released I think in the 90s too I thought that this would be very nice for Leah or Lainey or Kunani maybe in her room there's another sheep but this softie is brown colored and I think this is very unique because we have only the black, grey and white versions and usually the black and white so adorable and I have got this panther um, it's very interesting because the spots are blue but I like it very much it's very soft and very cute uh, my only problem is that during the storage the whiskers always bend so I have to do something with these and here's another teddy bear this one has a little heart in its pocket you can put it here this was also released for Valentine's Day. This sheep, which is a punk by the way, was released last year and it has a little friend which is a rat and the rat has lots of paint spots on it because they are uh, doing graffitis. That's why it has got this turquoise star and also his hair is this turquoise color. This one I purchased in the shop for half price. There was a time when you could buy fairies and this one is a flea market find. It's a very nice turquoise color. It has big wings on the back. Another sheep and it has a hoodie sheep with hoodie are so cute I have got a lion I have more lions by the way and this is a standing one and quite small so perfect for my dolls and I also have a tiger I think I bought from the same seller at the flea market this one I bought in a shop for half price this summer time Another panther, but this one has the real brown spots on it. Very soft. Another sheep word sheep. This is the girl version and I was happy to find it because I had the black one and after that I could purchase the white one. Here is another lion, a lying one. sitting giraffe. This hippo is quite old. It was also a Valentine's Day release. You can see the old tag on it. But very cute. This reindeer is also a half price purchase. And it's coming from the Happy Winter collection, which is this year's release. Another little sheep. Very small. This one is my newest find and I can say that this is my all-time favorite with this hair. It's so adorable. And this one is the collection called Let It Snow and it has got a rabbit for friend and here you can see the other things what you can buy so there are not only the plushies there are lots of uh, stationery and blanket and uh, bottle and these things oh and purses lots of mugs this one I bought for the real price, but I couldn't let it in the shop and I was very happy.